Polly here. Uh, what a day. I drove from my house in Seebeck all the way out to Port Angeles and back to pick up a new machine. Well, it's hardly new. But I pulled it in the back of my truck here, that's behind me, and let's take a look at it. Okay, she's rough, but here it is. The Sears ST16. Ugh, I know what you guys are thinking. What a piece of crap. But it's all there. I'm happy about that. And uh it's all there. Look at that. Look at that exhaust. Homemade. <clears throat> yes, the grill is jacked. I will fix it. I have no question how I will do it. I know how I'm going to do it. Uh, this thing is pretty much green. It's been sitting outside for about six years. But my buddy, who I got it from, said it ran when he, when he parked it. He actually, where I picked it up from, is where he parked it. I trust him on that. I believe him. Uh, dash looks good I think the uh, the light switch and the, the other uh, pull out throttle it might be frozen something I can definitely fix <clears throat> um, tires rear tires are good front tires are not Look at that fuel filter. <laughs> it's been a while. Tecumseh 10 horse. Now I got two of those. One on the wheel horse, one on the Sears. Um, I was going to get the, and you guys are going to say I should have got that. I was going to get the wheel horse C175. And uh, I changed my mind at the last minute. It's got a hydro rear end. And it did have a nice, beautiful V-twin in it, but uh, that one was made more for restoring. I already got a wheel horse that I'm trying to do something like that with, so I figure I can do this thing and get a little crazy with it. So, and I will. <laughs> no question about it. Front tires, uh, they need to be changed, of course. Yes, I want to get new wheels, new tires here for the rear. Guy made a mistake of saying in front of my wife that these will last forever. So I have to <laughs> convince her to let me get new ones. Not, I'll just get them. Okay, let me let's give it a wash down. See if we can get some of this green off. Well, it's been a long day. I'm tired of toying around with this thing, but I am very happy with the way it looks. And uh, the West Coast is very, when it comes to these things, it's very scarce. It's hard to find these. It's not like the Midwest or the East Coast. But I'm happy I got this one. And I'm telling you, when it's when I'm done, it's gonna look. Great. I already got my colors picked out. And I'm pretty excited about it. Until next time, I'm Paula.